Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am slotting in an extra video just because I know everybody is trying to stay at home during this global pandemic. So I'm going to show you my morning skincare routine. Um, <clears throat> sorry guys. I need my coffee. I made my Keurig coffee by uh, Maxwell House today. Um, changed it up a little bit. This is part of my morning routine. In the morning, I always wake up, make my coffee, come back to my bed, um, into my room. I usually work from home in my room, so this is where I usually work from home. Um, and, uh, in between I do my skincare routine when I have a minute. So, uh, I'm going to show you quickly what it is I put on my face in the morning. This is usually what I do before I go to work, um, or on the weekends when I wake up. Just when I wake up before I start my day. <clears throat> so first off, I'm going to take the Urban Decay B6 Vitamin Infused Complexion Prepping Priming Spray. Um, I use any toner or essence mist, anything like that. Right now I'm using this one only because, um, I'm trying to use it up to get it out of my collection. It's a, it's a pretty good mist. I have, I don't have any complaints with it. I just feel like it's overpriced for what it does. So I'm just dousing my face with that. Um, this is supposed to help with reducing redness and prep your skin for makeup. Um, I don't know if I'm going to put makeup on today. I haven't really decided. We'll see how it goes. But um, if you're looking for something a little more, you know, higher end but not too, too pricey, this is not a bad, this is not a bad spray. You do get, how many do you, how many ounces do you get here? I want to say four, but I could be wrong. Yes, it's four ounces. And this lasts for quite a while as well. So I'm just letting that lightly sink in. It's still a little bit damp on my skin while I wait for that. Um, I am going to apply my eye cream. This is the cream I use for my eyes day and night. This is the CeraVe Repair Eye Cream. Guys, it's a drugstore option. It is affordable and it works fantastic. So I put a little dollop on my finger, um, just emolli emollient it a little bit in between your fingers. I don't even know if emollient is a word, but whatever. Um, and just lightly just massage that into your under eye. I know that with everything going on right now, People can get a little bit down and in the gutter mentally. Um, I just want to say that everybody is going through that type of uh, feeling confined. And I feel like if you do a morning routine every morning while you're at home, it can help your mind and spirit a little bit. Um, I find that it does for me when I get up and I, you know, get ready so to speak in the morning it's it's just easier on my on my emotional and mental state um so next up um I don't know if you guys knew this but I'm sure you did when I'm applying products to my actual face I go in um in order of less um in order of of uh density or thickness so like lightest to heaviest so any water products are first and then like oils and heavy creams are at the end. Just so you guys know in case you didn't. So I'm going in with my vitamin C serum for the day. Um, this is the Drunk Elephant C for Med Day Serum. I love this stuff. I have a backup because this stuff is the bomb. Um, I usually do one or two pumps or one and a half. Um, depending on how I feel my skin is for that day. And again, just patting. Patting it in. 
Look at that glow that it's giving me. Wow. And then whatever is left on my hands, I just kind of bring down on my chest. Pat it in. If you guys see that I'm like really tan, it's because I used a self-tanner two days in a row. Don't judge me. When you're bored, you try to do things to keep occupied and self-tanning was one of them. Um, so I did that. So now, um, that's actually, this actually, this vitamin C really sinks into the skin really fast. Um, and it kind of leaves a bit of a tackiness, which is fine. I don't mind that. Um, so I'm going to go in now with my, uh, Drunk Elephant Be Hydra Intensive Hydration Gel. Um, this one I use one, two, sometimes three, um, pumps of it, depending on how much hydration I need. And again, patting it into the skin. I try not to rub my face as much um, just because rubbing does increase your um, your like your results of like fine lines and wrinkles so patting is your best bet of uh, of applying skin care okay so I did that. Um, this is a really great product for um, adding more hydration into the skin if uh, you need that extra layer of moisture uh, only because I find for me this is good on its own in the summer but I need it as a layer in the winter time because it's not enough hydration in the winter. It's added as an extra layer of hydration for me in the winter. And then finally, I'm going to go in with my moisturizer for the day. Um, I'm not leaving the house, so I'm not going to wear SPF. I didn't do any exfoliating, chemical exfoliants yesterday night. So I'm not going to do SPF since I'm not going anywhere today. Um, pretty much staying inside like everybody else in the world. Uh, so I'm going in with a hydrating gel cream, which is the Peter Thomas Roth Water Drench Hyaluronic Cloud Cream Hydrating Moisturizer. That's a lot. It says 30% hyaluronic acid complex draws uh, atmospheric vapor, helps lock in hydration for up to 72 hours for all skin types. Um, that claim, I don't really know because I don't, I don't use this once every 72 hours. That's three days, guys. I do my skincare religiously day and night. So I can't really agree with the claim of three days of moisture only because whoever's not washing their face at least once a day frightens me a little bit, you know? So um, I took a little spatula. I scooped out a, like a quarter, I would say quarter and a slight bit more of this on my spatula. I'm adding it into my hand and I'm going to massage this all over my face. This is a really um, hydrating cream but it's not like it's thick but it's not greasy is what I want to tell you. Um, whatever I have extra, I always bring it down on my neck, you guys. Make sure you do that when you're applying skincare because you don't want your neck and your chest to look like it's doubled its age. Usually skincare helps you look, you know, more youthful. Um, and you don't want your face to be looking youthful, but then your neck looks like it's shriveled up, you know? So, just bring it all down. I actually have to go to the drugstore probably next week to pick up some medication and I'd like to pick up a body um, wash, my Neutrogena body wash because I'm breaking out again on my body and it's really driving me crazy. Um, for those of you who um, suffer breakouts, body wash from um, Neutrogena is really good. That's the body acne one because it really does help and it's affordable. So that was the last step of my skincare. Usually what I do after this is SPF if I am going out, but because I am staying home, hashtag stay home people, um, I this will be my last step for today since I won't be seeing outside 
at all today. Um, and yeah, that was my morning skincare routine, you guys. Um, let me know down below if you want to see my nighttime skincare routine, and I can definitely do that for you. Um, I hope you guys are staying safe, you're staying home, and you are finding ways to keep busy during this hard time. I love you guys. Remember, be kind, and um, wash your hands.